want you to fuck on my nights, yeah, fuck on my nights, yeah, all of my nights, yeah. Oh, yeah, this could be more specific. Uh, I'm a human. It is our plan. And uh, I just want to... It's Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you're just joining us now, welcome! Today's video, I thought I would throw it back because I haven't done one of these videos in the longest time. It just, it hasn't happened. Talk about this loads but I went through a phase where I felt like I needed to be doing trending videos and if it wasn't trending then I wasn't allowed to put it on my channel and I was speaking to my friend Lucy Wood the other day and she was just like, hun, that mindset like no you post what you want boo you know and I kind of just realized like you know what Lucy you're a you're a woman of, of wisdom because I want to post videos that I enjoy doing and I don't want to have the pressure of trends I have did a full vlog where I moaned about this for five minutes so I'm not going to do that again okay and I, and I, and I often go through phases of, of telling you about this but I'm not going to do that again today I'm going to be going to Poundland b and m and tk maxx we're going to be doing like a come shop with me just a casual day chill type of thing might pick up some christmas presents might see what bargains they've got i have like literally started my christmas shopping i have got so much this year like it's literally unreal but you know what i'm kind of starting to think that it's maybe not a good idea that i've started because here's me thinking you know i'm all prepped i'm a I'm above everyone else, I'm above everyone else, I've started my bloody Christmas shopping, okay, but now I'm thinking, I'm not going to stop, like, on the lead up to Christmas, I'm not just going to think, oh, I've got enough for everyone now, I'm just going to keep bloody getting stuff, so, I mean, it's good for everyone that I'm buying for, because they'll have, you know, quite a bit of stuff, but for my bank balance, this ain't going to be good, I don't want to, like, not do any Christmas shopping in December, because then I won't be in the Christmas mood, do you know what I mean? Anyway, rant over, I've started my Christmas shopping, I'll probably get some more today, I'm very excited, I haven't been in these shops in quite a long time, I think I was in Poundland about a month ago, haven't been in a B&M in quite a while, and I haven't been in a JK Maxx in ages, so this is going to be, this is going to be exciting, like, we're going to see what goods they've got. First off, I'm going to do a little outfit of the day because I really like my outfit. So, these jeans are from Pretty Little Thing. I really like them. They're high-waisted and they're kind of like wide leg at the bottom and then they've got the slits at the knees. And then I just have these um, old-school vans on, which I actually recently got. Did you know? Because I didn't know. Last time I purchased vans, they were £40. I purchased these two days ago. £60 for vans, hello, they were never that expensive, anyway, I still got them because I really like them and I think they go with everything and then I have this little mesh bodycon on which I actually really like, it's like all polka dotty and mesh um, but yeah, I will have my full outfit linked below for you then I'm going to put on my coat, this is like my favourite coat at the moment, it is from Boohoo and it's like a puffer coat but wait there wait till you see oh fix the collar kind of stone coat but oh my god i love it and then the little bag i've been using recently is this one and i'm not actually sure what that means you know i just don't know but it is tiny like literally it's not much bigger than my hand but i really like it it just fits my purse a little perfume slide my phone in there my keys and that's it done but yeah i really like this bag i've been using it quite a lot recently i actually got it from a website called yes style which i will have if i can find it i will link the bag below um but yeah so this is my outfit of the day we are gonna head to the shops oh i'm so excited does anybody else who's a cheap shop lover like me ever like if you haven't been to them in a while like start to crave them a bit but then also like when you go in, like today, I'm going to my favourite chip shops. Do you like feel so excited? Like, yay! you get the giddies, you get all tickly because it's like exciting. You're going to your cheap shops where you can buy loads of stuff that you don't need but you just need. Do you know what I mean? Oh, I just like think it's like an exciting time, okay? It's like really exciting and I'm really excited. I want you to rule my life, you to rule my life, you to rule my life, yeah. I want you to fuck my nights, yeah, fuck my nights, yeah, all of my nights. It is our planet. We love each other. 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 It is our planet. We love each
the mountain So you know you're gonna do some damage when you get yourself a basket when you come in. But I just need one, you know. Okay, oh my god. Look at these that I've just seen. Doggy chocolate, but it's like Scooby-Doo themed. And then they've also got it in three flavours. So they've got a white one, a caramel one, and a dark one. But then they also do doggy, like meat hot dogs for dogs. That's so cute, love that. got quite a selection of like sweets for stocking fillers obviously we've got Halloween and then Christmas coming up we've got the Reese's in as well which usually they're really expensive but you can get like hampers of them for like five pound you've got a pick and mix good selection of sweeties here you've got all the big boxes of chocolate at the top so you've got like the milk trays for 3.99 you have the dairy box and then you also got the um, Terry's all gold and then some Thornton's and then a fries one the fries one's only 1.99 a good stocking filler i know the blue fries is actually vegan so maybe that full box is vegan i don't know i have to check you've got ferrero rochers black magic maltesers great for little stocking fillers okay so unfortunately the box isn't vegan because the turkish delight in the middle actually contains milk but these two are vegan so you were nearly there fries you were nearly there but you do get you have got the separate ones here as well if you are interested in them Guys, have you ever had these Rubicon drinks? They are so nice. I love the black cherry and raspberry one and it's 12 calories a bottle and it's literally got like 0.5 sugar on it. Honestly, they're so good. Especially because when I'm doing good, like I like water but I get sick of the taste of it. So these are like amazing. All Christmas themed. You have the doggy advent calendars, Scooby-Doo themed and then some little mini pies. I think I'm going to get the advent calendar for Dolly. I want to check what's in it though because I don't really like having raw hind or hind, whatever it's called. Um, oh my god, Dolly loves the toothbrush and that. And them, like them animals. I might get her them because I know she does love treats like that. But yeah, look, they've got all the little stock and fillers in and everything for the dogs. I just think it's such a cute time. Oh look, a Christmas dinner. Oh my god, how cute. And then they've got like snowmen, a bamboo bone, and then obviously loads of toys as well that you can get for them. I just love this time of year. Like everything's so Christmassy and it's just mint. Just seen this Starburst lip smacker set. I actually think this is super cute. And it's only three pounds. Great little stock and filler. And then um like look at the selection of makeup they've got in at the minute. They've got like Max Factor mascara, some foundation from Max Factor, like a CC cream. They've got a bit of NYX stuff. I always feel um, B and M have like a really good range of what do you call it makeup. And then they've also got some bits and bobs. Yeah, little beauty blender. Yeah, I always feel like they have such a good range of stuff. You've got your oval pads, all your makeup wipes. You know, just your necessities. I think these are so cute if you've got kids. They've got little chef sets with three pieces. So they come with um, a chef hat, an apron, and a tea towel. And then they've also got like different themed ones. There's like a robot one at the back and then like another themed one there. I think they're so cute for five pound. Like if kids like cooking, come to B&M. This is the aisle you want to be in for your stock and fillers. Look at that, a Pring Pringles advent calendar reduced to 4.49 all of these like i just get so excited about all of this type of stuff because it just like it's just christmas isn't it like this aisle only comes about when christmas is here it's just so much i think i'm in like the sweet stock and filler aisle that would be great for my brother he loves sour sweet look at that that would be mint oh look at that candy cables like giant for 1.99 like i think oh, look at that down there man sweet hamper i think why i love B&M sweet hampers is because it's all like novelty sweets but instead of playing like the prices that this type of thing would be online it's like so cheap you've got like the adult ones so, like the Guinness the like liqueurs there's just so much stuff look at that if I wasn't vegan I would definitely be having that I used to love chocolate fingers look at that it's got Oreos in it I can actually have Oreos but I don't like them sad times oh my god if you know someone who loves shortbread get here look at that big box it's just so much look at that little retro tin Oh, all the advent calendars. Oh, a Bourneville one. Oh my God, is that vegan? That will be vegan, oh my God, yes. Bourneville chocolate, lovely. All of this, like, it's just mint, you know? Gotta love buying them for this sort of stuff. And then you've got like your cheesy stuff. I just love it, you know? I'm honestly such a kid. Look at this floating poo, that's on like a 
so cool. And then you put it in and it's poo. I found that way funnier than I should have for 23 years of age. Oh my God, look, scented slime. Jelly Belly have brought slime out. There's just so much stuff. So this is like obviously the stock and forget I you. Oh my God, something just made a noise and I don't know what it was. I shit myself, I did. Um, but yeah, you've got all your like men's stock and fillers. You've got your women's. I love things like this, like a mug with a hot chocolate and my mellows. Love that. And then you've got like your board games and stuff. It's so cute. And then um, all your links. Just, you know, your bits and bobs that you need every Christmas for everyone. Oh, look at these themed cups. Dip dab, fruit salad. I've got a Mario Kart one. Harry Potter themed ones, friends, there's just so much. Um, and then you've got like your girly stock and fillers. I love this retro looking hairdryer. I've seen it not long ago and I actually sent a picture of it to Sean because I just think it's lush. Love that. Um, oh look, and then you have all your name themed stuff. So if you want to get some personalised stuff for people, you've got all your names and like nice pastel colours. Love that. Oh, your neon signs. Everybody loves a neon sign these days. They have a really good range of like diffusers and candles, yeah, if that's something you know, there's like so many scents. You have like fresh linen, vanilla, orange mist, um, you've got like a floral scent, and then you've got lavender down at the bottom that are like colour themed to match the scent as well. And then you've got like these ones which are a bit more plain looking, um, but you have blackberry and bay, you have like two sizes, um, and then you also have the candles as well. So yeah, they're really cute. I know I did like come out late, like it wasn't a full day, but like it gets dark so quick these days. Like I'm like it's bloody dark. Anyway, B and M was spend seventeen pound. Not too bad. Usually I spend way more on B and M, but I didn't, it wasn't like loads I wanted. But I got a few bits and bobs, and I think I'm gonna go to Poundland next because I'm ready. Seeing these, these are new. These are soft and gentle, but I've never seen these before. They've got like new packaging, but they've got exotic bloom, flower fever, and petal power. I think they're so cute. And then I also seen this as well. This is by Simple, and it's a deep cleansing max. I've seen the sheet masks before, but I've never seen this, so I think it's new. And then they've got like the near hair remover. I used to use that loads when I was younger, but now I just shave. Just noticed this, this is a Tresemme Thickening Balm. I actually need this because my hair is um, really thinned out since I had my hair disaster. So I might try this, right, I might try this actually because it looks good. Um, but then they've also got quite a few Tresemme items which I know is like really expensive in Asda. But yeah, this is like a mousse. Who uses mousse? Like what do you do with mousse? I think my grandma still uses mousse. I've never been a mousse type of girl, not gonna lie. And then I think they've got the hairspray as well. Yeah, they do. Poundland are killing it with Tresemme right now. I've just seen this bargain for £12 in Poundland, but it's kind of like got the Burberry pattern on it and it's this nice stone taupe colour. I think this is a bargain and I think it's so nice. I've got like my taupe coat on, but I like this. I might try it on because um, £12 for a Burberry coat will love a bargain. So I've never seen this before. They've got like a um, range with like actual real petals in. So this is rose petals in like a body oil, I think it is. Yes, it's, oh no, sorry, it's a bath oil, I'm trying to show you, but we have bath oils here, and then they also have some, like, bath bars with, like, actual petals in them, and then a roll-on, but yeah, I've never seen these before. Oh, they've also got a lavender pillow spray, I used to use a pillow spray, that's quite interesting, and then you've got some little sets where you've got, like, hand cream and stuff, really cute, some little makeup bags and some makeup. Oh, and you've got these little shimmer drops. These are really good for adding in with foundation if you want like a glowy look. But obviously, I don't know what Poundlands ones are like. Um, and they also have a highlighter here as well, with a little manicure set. They've got loads of little stocking fillers here, actually, really cute. Um, you've got some different little soaps down here, some makeup. Yeah, and they've actually got little lip kits as well. If you've got like someone just getting into makeup with a lip liner and a gloss, these are like so cute. They have so many cute little gift sets in, a little stock and fill asset. Then you've also got the comedy ones, which they do every year, where you've got like the mugs and the savers and all that type of thing. But yeah, I really like Poundland for their little stock and gifts. Okay, guys, I'm not asking this in like a rude way. Oh, by the way, we spent twelve pound in Poundland. It's not too bad. Um, I'm not asking this in a rude way, but just in totally like I'm uneducated way. But I've never worked in a shop, so if you've worked in a shop, please enlighten me to this. 
But you know when you buy stuff in a shop and then they have like a certain thing at the till that they're asking every customer once they've paid for the stuff, are you interested in some chocolate or some batteries? Like why is that? Like if I was interested I would have picked it up in the shop. Is it because they're trying to get rid of stock or something? Like I don't get why they ask. Because nearly everybody says no to them as well, so, like, why? Please enlighten me as to why. I'm guessing it's just a marketing technique or it's something that they're desperately trying to get rid of. But I just, like, like if I wanted it, I would have picked it up. Okay, so we are now in TK Maxx. I've actually moved it around a bit, but I love the sets from TK Maxx. I think they're so cute. Like, I just, I'm easily sold by packaging. Um, but look, they've got so much stuff. Like, where do I even look first? It's so exciting. They've got like they've got like stuff for everything. Like I just love TK Maxx. I think they just know, you know, they know the score. Kinda wanna buy one of these for myself. It's a soothing complex set, but it's got like a sheet mask in and then one of them rollers that I say like all over the place and then it's got like a rose oil then they've also got a different one I think that one will probably be lavender behind but I really want this for myself but I know that I shouldn't but like I really just want this tool and plus I like the sheet mask and I like oil so I feel like yeah I really want it okay should I get it I don't know they've got this little Emma Hardy cracker honestly Emma Hardy is so good I used to use the cleanser all the time and it's $7.99 but you get a cleansing cloth the cleanser and I think that's a moisturizer as well um, but that is so good value because Emma Hardley is actually really expensive. Oh my god, I found another one of them things. This one's four and oh no, this one hasn't got a sheet mask in though. I'm not loving that. I love a sheet mask. Oh look at that, they've got a Jas Jasper Conrad set for $9.99 and then they've got the Elizabeth Arden white tea set as well. Love it. Oh look at this. Come on, bath jewel like petals and stuff. I hate them. I'm not being funny, but every time I get them in a set, I just don't use them. I like that. Looks cute. Soothing body travel set. I'm just obsessed. Oh look, if anybody uses an eye mask, there's a nice one for them. Bed head stuff. I've got some more hair sets. Look at these big sets of stuff. Oh my god, I'm just so excited for Christmas. Then you also have like some makeup set, technique, hot water bottle. Oh look at that. Love that set. That actually looks so cute. Coconut oil and shea butter are like a massive set. I actually really like that. And they've got some more here, Bayless and Harden. I just love it. Okay guys, remember when I showed you this in Poundland? It was the simple deep cleansing face mask. I've actually just found it in TK Maxx. And well, that one hasn't got the price on, but the one below has the price on. And it says 2 .99. So yeah, I really like that. Um, but I would get it in Poundland because it is a pound. Just had a shower and washed my hair but that is the end of this come shop with me you used to love when i do these videos so if you like it be sure to let us know by giving this one a thumbs up it helps out a lot subscribe down below if you haven't already but without further rat -a -tat, tat i will let you go and i will see you very shortly for another video bye <laughs>